Hey guys, Max Soapy Queen here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Snakewood. Uh, so I know things might look a little different from where we left off. Do not fear, they are not any different. We are still in the boardroom of the Inquisition. What is on the other side of the table? And uh, I've been fighting Inquisition people for a while now. I told you guys in the last episode that when we get to the boardroom, it's going to be... A lot of me cutting and stuff like that and saying hold on just a second because I have to look at a map and see exactly where to go because if you touch the wrong spot on this floor you have to start all over again from the beginning and I'm gonna show you guys what I mean intruder detected removing intruder you will go all the way back to the beginning if you are up there and if you are not you will go all the way back here so this is what I've been doing I found a map on the internet and I went and went through the boardroom all the way so there's a special path that I took to get here and um, that's where I went to I took on all those Inquisition people on that side of the table and now I'm going to load my game back here really quickly load, load. there we go because I don't want to have to do all that again I took on just about every one of the Inquisition people except for this person here because you really didn't miss anything. I didn't even read their text because um, their text is stupid. Anyway, I took on all those people and decided, okay that guy said some weird stuff. I really just super sped through the rest of them because uh, they pretty much just had these guys here, Reeps and stuff like that, and um, you know, I, I wasn't really a big fan of having to super speed through all of them, and I'm sure you guys probably didn't want to see it because they mostly had Reeps and like those weird Pokemon that you, uh, you've you seen before, I can't think of the name of them now, they look like a silver guy or whatever. So I decided to cut that out and go ahead and let you guys see the last one and see what I've been doing probably for the past past 15 minutes or so just fighting Inqu Inquisition people and I'm lucky there was a bag there because that really helped me out so I could go ahead and heal up my Pokemon after each battle because I really needed to, needed to do that so that helped me out a bunch I'm thinking though once we get out of this boardroom place we won't have to worry about the, the floor anymore so that's that's good that's literally the most annoying thing ever is that floor. I tried to do it on my, my own. I really did. But I was getting nowhere. Nowhere fast. Because I kept stepping on the wrong one. And it just wasn't working out for me. So decided not to go ahead and do it myself. And got a guide to get through it. And that worked out pretty well for me. Alright, so this sand tomb should take out that Mareep. And that's good game for the last Inquisition member. And we are out of the boardroom. Well, we're not out of the boardroom yet, but we're pretty much done taking on Inquisition people. So I'm gonna go heal up one more time here. There we go. And I think I pretty much got the way to go. Or not, there's more intruder, I mean, there's more Inquisition people than I thought there would be. Oh, I just ran past one of them. I didn't really run, I just super sped. Grim Reaper, that is the power of my attack, blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah, okay. Apparently this is the way to go then. And he has a Dratini. Alright, well I'm going to confuse this Dratini. Because it's got Draco Fury. And I'm gonna use my wing attacks on it. Take out this guy really quickly. Pelper Grow to level 32 on. And now we can take on this guy that we missed. Well, he missed us. We didn't miss him. They also have these Caffy things as well. So we will be taking on those guys. And you're using Swagger. Gee, thanks a whole bunch. That helped me out a lot. Healing up again. Why do they just keep reappearing and disappearing? Just like that. And there's another one. 
Yeah, I've been meaning to ask you, why are you suddenly so friendly with me? Because we're friends. I wrote you another haiku, wanna hear? Please, no. Here I go. All for your delight. Though we are not here, cinnamon is good. Alright, that was the worst haiku I've ever heard. Have to say. Gotta be pretty bad. Alright, I think this is the area where... Yeah, this is where I gotta... Go right... Yeah. Right here, and then I go like this. And then I don't know where to go after this, so... Just one second. Okay, so I decided to go ahead and cut because it was taking me too long. So now I made it through the boardroom. Yay! Yes, I did make it through the boardroom. Now we're gonna fight Inquisition Salaryman. Salaryman? Really? I'm gonna send a Pelipper. Gonna confuse this guy. He's gonna hurt himself in confusion, and I'm gonna water gun him and take him out. Like in Pelipper right now. Like in Pelipper. Although I could use a better attack than um, Water Gun, but hey, Water Gun's doing some good right now. So I'm not really too worried. Alright, took him out Salaruman and almost grew into level 32. So hopefully I have a Paralyzed Hill. Yes, I do. I have one. Lucky me. I'm definitely gonna take the opportunity to have that because I don't want to go all the way back. <laughs> Alright, here's another Salaruman. Graveler. No problem. Your goblin is going out in one hit. Thank you very much. Alright, so Pelipper's doing okay with levels. Gonna switch into Quillfish here. Quillfish could definitely use some levels too, so we gotta gotta help everybody out. Alright, finally. We are out. And now we're running into more things. You got past our boardroom? Well, meddling kid, this is one room you won't get through. I beg to differ. Especially with you guys and your rock types. You kind of no match for my uh, water and grass types. The Inquisition people weren't too bad, but you know, you got Alright, I'll tell you. The X panels on the floor unleash away as a terrible wild Pokemon. Great. That sounds like a Numel, but it's a Hombone. Level 5. Really? I don't think those are too terrible. I'm just gonna go straight here. Graveler, level 5. Really, these guys are so strong. I'm so scared. Another Graveler. Not strong at all. And another Numel. Just kidding, it was a Hombone. The Hombones sound like Numels. I'm guessing they took Numels out of the game. I'm literally losing all of my surfs to these guys. I don't like this at all. Alright, that's good. I can use Pin Missile. I don't know why I'm cutting those out. Because all it is is level 5 Geodudes and Hombones. So I don't really think, see the point of me cutting them out. I guess I'll just go ahead and leave them in. Because I think we're almost done anyway. Couple more level five hombones and geodudes, and we should we should be good. Yeah, I think that's about it. No more. Nope. There's more. So I'm gonna take on you. I guess I got lucky. Got all the level fives. Oh, Fampy, that's pretty cool. Level seven. Still not good, but yeah, that's pretty cool. And another Geodude. Pin missile it up then. Since they're only level 5, it's pretty easy to take them out. Let's go this way. See what else we can find. Hombone again? Alright, I guess that Fampy was like the, the rare one that you could find in this area. Yeah, there it is again. Not really that big of a deal. I actually, I think I ran into a Fampy. No, I think that was on Dark Rising. I ran into a Fampy on Dark Rising and I didn't... I wanted to ca catch it, but I decided against catching it because we, uh, I think we already had... Um... Whatchamacallit, a Rock-type on our team anyway, so... Not that big of a deal. Okay, so here's a bag. I'm gonna use this bag. And we're gonna go this way. Take on this last level 5 Hombone. And we're gonna go in here. 
please, no more tricks, you guys. I really just want to get out of here. Okay, so I see a lot of places we could go. Let's go this way, because there's an item right there. Max elixir. Alright, that could come in use for us. So. I'd stop you, but that constitute work, and that's not allowed in the employee garden. Oh, we're in the employee garden. I want to stop you as a little Inquisition employee, but I can't, since this is a work-free zone. Aw, too bad. This guy will try and stop me, though. I'm on my way to the employee garden, but as a little as salary man, I have no option but to destroy you. Well, alrighty, man. Man, go ahead. Try to destroy me. Doesn't look like it's working out too well. Quillfish is going to grow to level 32. Looking good. And this guy's going to send in more Hombones and Geodudes. Ooh, a Relicanth. Okay, that's that's different. I don't know why I just used that. That was literally no use to me. And I'm going to be asleep. Okay. Well, I actually want to wake up, so... <laughs> Since this guy can't really do anything to me anyway. I'm going to go ahead and wake up. Come on, Quillfish, wake up. You're about to die. Gosh dang it. I should take out that Relicanth, and I should get all my HP back. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up. I think I have I have one soda pop here. Uh, three super potions. Use a super potion, and I don't think I have anything for waking myself up. So, Coolfish can just go back to the back anyway, because it's level 32. Same as Pelipper. We'll just stick with Berloom right now. So, let's see. Where are we supposed to go is the question. There's two different paths. Oh. My. Gosh. You've got to be kidding me. Uh-uh. No. No. No, that's not happening. Okay. Went back and did all of that crap again. So now we have to decide which way to go. I'm gonna go on this one. And we'll surround my Pokemon. Tile flash black, a faint noise sounds in the distance. Something dark is coming. Okay. Looks like we're going to fight. Nothing. Shadowroo sent out Shadowroo. Level 80. Oh, joy. Joy. And what am I supposed to do against this thing? What What do you suppose I'm to do against the level 80? Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, exactly. Obviously, this is not the right way to go. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I protected myself. Gee, that helped for about two seconds. And I'm not doing that again, so I will be right back. Okay, so let's try going this way. And going this way, maybe? And maybe this way here? Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting on this one. Yay, we did it! That's good. I actually just guessed, so... Dungeons ahead, just past the storeroom. Okay. Luckily we're going the right way now. No, it's impossible that you got this far. Actually, it was kind of pure luck that I got this far because I, uh... actually wasn't planning on getting this far. This fast. I kind of just took a chance and picked a couple. Kind of like, um, when you go to... whatever it's called, um... In the first Pokemon, flashlights needed to progress further. I don't think I have a flashlight. Everything past the Leap of Faith is strictly off limits, even more so than the rest of our building. Okay, well, anyway, uh, let's see, what was I saying? Jasmine? Is it Jasmine? I don't know, whoever has that gem in, uh, that city in, like, the first generation of Pokemon, where she had those, um, weird little circly things set up. That would be what I'm talking about. I kind of went off of like that, so in, on hers you kind of just go like in a little circle. Whatever one you're on. 
you just go to the next one and then the next one and the next one and all that stuff. So that's what I decided to do with that one. Kind of like in a counterclockwise motion. If that helps. I don't know. Just took a, 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 a guess and I got right. Lunatone. Alright, I'll stay in. Let's just stun for it real quick. Get some paralysis up. Mega Drain. And does Mock Punch do a lot? Yeah. Well, not really. It's just critical hit. And another Hombone. Alright. Mega Drain it is. I am running out of Mega Drains. And I realized I have the wrong Breloom. But I can't actually get my other Breloom because, uh, I need cut, so I'm going to have to go with this balloon right now, which is alright I guess. It's our first balloon we had, so not complaining. Okay, what do you say? Well, I guess you won't get much further without a flashlight or a torch. Okay, what is that, what is that supposed to mean? Hang on here, let me just go ahead and save. Okay, so... Can I... Go this way? I'm not really sure which way to go. Oh, well maybe that's it. Maybe I didn't need a flashlight after all. I just got really lucky. So I'm guessing I'm supposed to go that way. But I want to check up here first to see if there's an item. Because I went back to the Inquisition boardroom and there actually was an item there. There was a nest ball, so I got that. Please tell me we are almost there to wherever we are going. I'm not actually sure where exactly we're going. But what I do know is now is not the time to have Vulpex. Alright, I should have definitely switched. And uh, this Corsola is part rock type. You just toxic Pikachu. How could you do that? No, blah, blah, blah. Okay, hang on. Hang on. I think I got some stuff in here. Mmm, zombie liver heals the magpies. Um, soda pop. No, I need a revive. Stores HP, calm spirits, fossil friendship, super potion, thunderstone, those PP, nugget. Alright, well, I guess I won't be healing up Vulpex unless we can find a bag soon. And Pikachu's probably gonna die as well. Because I don't have anything for Pikachu either. Unless we can find something to heal. Nope, that isn't a spawn. That is not going to help us heal up our poison. And I don't think I have a repel either, which is even worse because we do run into wild Pokemon. Like that Hombone, we are going to be in some serious trouble. And I don't really want to use any of my healing items. I'm hoping we can find a bag around here somewhere. And there's a guy down there. I'm guessing we're going the right way. I'm just following these guys. Man, these wild Pokemon are getting my nerves. Hey, stop, kid. You can't go past here. Why not? Why not? Okay, this is not a good matchup at all. Uh, I guess I'll just keep Pikachu. No, I'll switch Pikachu out with Quillfish here. So Quillfish can just take him out with one hit. Say, say beam on that uh, person right there. Surf and side beam. There we go. That's good. That's good. Everybody's getting some EXP. And this should be no problemo again. Taking out Hombone and Silrock is next. That did not do crap. But that did. Loving Quillfish right now, so I'm actually glad that I have Quillfish with me. Okay, what's going on? Please! Ah, ghost, I see you come to rescue me. If you come over here, I can explain further. Uh, how? You're surrounded by lava. No, I'm not. The Inquisition seemed to not have any, seemed to not have any, so they used an orange aid instead. You can easily surf across. Okay. Let's surf across the lava. I mean, some orange soda or something. I don't know. There's no time to lose. The Inquisition got me by surprise and took my Pokey gear. 
It's a vintage Johto model that I built in Conduit for the tail. If you could get it back from the Inquisition scientist, I could blast this out of here in no time at all. Alright, well I guess that means I gotta go this way, because I don't think we can go back the other way. Let's just go this way. I really wish he would have healed up our Pokemon though, that really would help me out a whole bunch. Because I am running low on HP right now and I'm not sure where to go. And Pikachu's gonna die in about 9, uh, 8, 7, 6, nah, 5, 4, 3, 2, there goes Pikachu. Yep. Really need a bag to heal up, please. That would be amazing right now. Just about lost Boltoy too. So I'm using Super Potion on Boltoy here. Hopefully we'll be close to a bag pretty soon. The dungeons are off limits. Then why am I in them? Is my question to you, sir. Did not mean to use that. And you're going to take out... No, you're not going to take out my ball toy. Mock punch it up in here. And take out your graveler. Come on! I didn't know graveler could use protect. It's just weird. Alright, please tell me. Why are today's youngsters so powerful and rebellious? I don't know. Well, okay, where are we now? Boss's garden. No intruders. Okay, I'm gonna save because I'm not actually sure what happens if we jump down there. But I won't know until I try. So we can't go in there. Obviously. And there's a cave over there. And we can't go this way, so we're gonna go in this cave here. And there's a scientist. What? Give back Lisa's Pokey Gear? No way. I need it for my research. Plus, I can control his, his Pokemon this way. In fact, let me demonstrate. Alright, my friend. You demonstrate. Please tell me you have rock types. Or not. Okay, that, that, that doesn't help me at all. That's actually very bad. Because my Pokemon are not healed up. It's not fair. And I don't have anything that I can do against you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Reloom. I'm scared for you, my friend. Really am. Okay, maybe we could just surf our way out of this. Yeah, there we go. Uh, switch back into Pelipper. Because we are cursed now. And let's go with some water gun. Did I water gun? Wing attack? I wing attack. Barrier. Okay, that's not going to help. Uh, I forgot what that said. Quillfish. Okay. That's fine. Quillfish against Quill Quillfish. Since Quillfish is our only Pokemon left. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Well, I don't have anything else to switch into, so, you know. Good luck with that. Alright, I've got to heal up. Oh, not these things. Not these things. This thing's gonna take me out. Oh, what do I have that can attack this thing? There we go. Defeated the scientist. Just barely. Well, we should go to level 33. What? Even Gleason's powerful Pokemon couldn't beat you? Oh, those were his Pokemon? <gasps> oh, Quillfish is evolving. Yay! So this is why I got myself a Quillfish. Because in this game, it evolves into some awesome, awesome Pokemon. Quill Shark, I think it's called. Quillfish evolved into Quill Shark. Yeah. Pretty cool. I know, I failed because Gleason's Pokemon will only obey their true owner. I guess I have no choice. Here, take this Poke Gear. Alright, we got the Poke Gear for Gleason. You might as well have this too. After all, you've legitimately defeated Watson. The Dynamo Badge? Okay. Earning badges everywhere. Even though we're not even battling gym leaders. Now get out of my sight. Please don't tell me I have to go through all that again. Because I really don't want to do that. No, 
Okay, good. Good. Yeah, I know where we're at. We're good. We're good. We just gotta surf, right? Yeah, we just gotta surf down that way. And we will reach Gleese, and we can finally get out of here. That way we can finally heal up our Pokemon is what I want to do. Alright, there's Gleese right there. Of course I had to run into a wild Pokemon. Alright, Gleese, here's your thing. Splendid, you got my Pokemon Poke gear back. Now let's go. Did you hear that? What? I can't hear anything. It's the Inquisition. I feel their presence is just disturbing the tail. Listen, I'll teleport you out of here with my Poke gear. I think I'll have a little fun with these vermin. Now that Face Leech and I have been reun are reunited once more. But before I do, please take this as thanks for helping me out. HMO6. Alright, not sure what that is, but thank you. Thank you, Strength. Really? Thanks, Gleese. Yes, yes. Now go. Your Pokemon look like they've had more than enough of the Inquisition. Yay. Yay! We are in Malville City and we can get healed up. Yay! Sorry, so let's see what Gleese gave us real quick. I'm guessing it's Strength. No, it's Rock Smash. Alright, that's good. That means we can finally go up that drought up here. But we will obviously have to do that in the next episode. Because we cannot do it in this episode. We have took way too long to get out of that stupid boardroom area and Inquisition base as it is. So in the next episode, we will go ahead and... Uh, continue on our journey in Pokemon Snakewood, but for now we are going to end the episode off here. So if you liked the video, leave a like, subscribe to watch more Snakewood, or any of my other Let's Plays, and uh, if you want to leave a comment, that's great because I love to read comments. They are much appreciated. I will see you guys in the next episode of Pokemon Snakewood.